The process of withdrawing U.S. troops from Niger is progressing rapidly. Since the signing of the withdrawal agreement on May 19, 2024, more than 269 of the 946 troops initially stationed have left the country. Some 1,100 of them have returned to the base at Niamey International Airport following the signing of the withdrawal agreements between the two countries. According to a joint press release, the departure of these first soldiers on a C-130 aircraft marks the start of a series of jumbo jet rotations designed to repatriate military personnel and equipment. Several tons of equipment have already been evacuated from Niger as part of this complex logistical operation. On May 19, 2024, Niger and the United States signed a withdrawal agreement stipulating that the last American soldiers must leave Niger no later than September 15, 2024. Faced with Niamey's demands, Washington agreed in mid-April to withdraw its soldiers deployed in the fight against jihadism. This withdrawal is in addition to that of the French army. For a time, the United States had hoped to remain in Niger, but relations worsened in March following the visit of the American delegation. According to the Nigerian government, the Assistant Secretary of State for African Affairs threatened the authorities in Niamey with sanctions if Niger signed an agreement to sell its uranium reserves to Iran.